Hi, everyone. Um, my name is Cecile. Uh, I, was, uh, I work for the Paris Region Economic Development Agency, and we're going to present you uh, some of the companies that work in the Paris Region um, and explain why the Paris Region is uh, good for, uh, the open, for OpenStack. So um, we are a non-profit organization, um, and uh, uh, we just merged with another non-profit organization in the region. Our main goal is to support uh, Paris region companies to grow in the region. We help this company with um, international development, innovation, R&D, uh, sustainable development, and we also support foreign company to invest and set up into the region. We are located in various places, San Francisco, Shanghai, uh, Israel and Boston, um, and we have a lot of experts in various uh, areas of the industry. So my main goal um, is to encourage foreign company to invest, expand, grow in the region, and finally set up. We can provide free and confidential services um, in order to help uh, you to recruit, uh, to find your premises, to have all the information you need to make decisions about legal structure and, and tax in the region. Uh, we also help in business development. part of it and make it big in the Paris region? Okay, well, let me walk you through the top 10 reasons you should definitely invest in us. Paris region is a key business hub lying strategically at the crossroads of Europe. In here, you can find all the major economic activity sectors. The French are renowned for being red host, and that's true in the business world too. Plenty of businesses have succeeded here. Bravo! This hotspot for innovation has attracted 100,000 researchers, filing the highest number of high-tech patents worldwide. We can boast being Europe's number one region for research and development. Paris region also provides a world-class real estate offer with Europe's biggest stock of commercial space. So don't worry, there's plenty of room for you. The region has outstanding transport connections with a vast efficient transport system including ports, railways and of course three international airports. All the main European cities are within easy reach. Paris region is a great source of diverse talent. Europe's largest concentration of higher education students can be found here. That's why you'll find a highly skilled workforce for hire. We're also not afraid of taking on ambitious urban development projects, especially when they're eco-friendly. We are proud of our extensive transport network, which we're constantly developing to facilitate your daily commuting. Yours to choose. What about train, metro, bus or bike? Paris region is the world's number one tourist destination, mais oui. 42 million people come each year from all over the world to visit our superb sites. Come here and see for yourself. The region has a unique heritage with its famous museums and world-renowned places, not to mention its amazing food. Voila, voila. What more could you possibly need to succeed in the Paris region? We're right here waiting. Okay, so um, um, I want just to tell you a small story. Um, two years ago, um, I met with the OpenStack Foundation and we thought with the people involved into the cloud and the open source space in the Paris region that this will, if, if we can bring the summit to Paris, then it will uh, help the adoption of cloud technology in the Paris region. So we've been working uh, with the foundation for two years, uh, bringing the summit in here with a lot of partners. Um, 
And we took the opportunity to have the OpenStack Summit in Paris to gather other events during what we call the Open Source Week Paris. So we had the Open Compute Project Summit last week in Paris-Saclay, in the south of the Paris region. We had the Audible UF, it's a community, open source community event gathering the whole ecosystem uh, of open source players. Um, the summit now and the OWU2 con, uh, conference started from today and the last, uh, the, the next two days. Um, it's, it's a consortium of middleware uh, actors um, working on research and development uh, with open source technologies. And this is a small quote that we got from Jonathan about the choice of, of Paris for this summit. Uh, I don't know if you, if you know that, but the uh, highest, um, uh, the biggest community of open source, of uh, OpenStack uh, developers in Europe are in France. This is some material that we put together for the Open Source Week Paris. So if you want, we have printed copies of open source uh, overview market in the region. Uh, and we also have an infography uh, about the open source market, the pure players, and the users, your customers uh, here in the region. You can find paris.paris.region.com. Uh, and then we choose to uh, give uh, the stage to uh, two, uh, to four companies, two um, small startups dealing with OpenStack, one Canadian company uh, s that set up in the region uh, the, 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 the previous months, and uh, one uh, open source uh, integrator. And these are my contact details, and now they're going to explain what they do. Hi, everybody. So sometimes pictures are better than a long story, but uh, we used to work for American companies. And it's already always funny for us when we are going in a, in a French restaurant and we bring the best and the, waste, the best Frenchies to Amer American people and friends. So it's just a private joke, but I do only hope that you guys have enjoyed uh, the summit in Paris. If not, that just means that you need to come back or come more often and contact Cecil for this purpose. So back to business, who we are and what we are doing. So I'm Yassin Kedash, co-founder and CTO of a company which is named Aliseo. We are, we are based in Paris region and we are 100% focused and dedicated to infrastructure, which means our core business is only and mainly to design infrastructures for the data center our background and uh, engineers within the company are, are very strong background on hosting company, ISPs, and telco. That's where we are coming from. We have a very, very strong expertise on most of the, the aspect within the data center. We have a huge portfolio from storage equipment to servers, um, including the application on the top, and, and of course, the network and all the con connective in the middle. That's really where we are good at. We don't care that much about uh, buzzword and marketing bullshit, to be honest. We are a really engineer company. But uh, when we are saying green IT, we are very, very focused on power uh, efficiency. And we use to tightly link the hardware with the application we're going to put on, on, on the application that's going to fit on it. So we, are, uh, we have a very strong focus on cloud deployment infrastructures. And all main activity is really to build turnkey solution and design solution from end to end. And that's why our customer love us. So I'll just give you some short references. So as I said, we, we are mainly working for hosts on telco and ISP. So we, we know, I mean, certainly all the data centers of Europe, because we, did, we have done some deployment in most of them. We have 80% of our existing customer base is located in Paris, or at least in France but we also have a lot of customers all over Europe. And we have uh, been contracted by a company like uh, Coret, for example, to provide uh, Cinder integration within OpenStack. 
So we are uh, an OpenStack contributor. Uh, we have done the Cinder implementation for Coret for Grizzly. And we have, uh, I mean, as you can notice, we are listed on, on the OpenStack website on Sun, like, like plenty of uh, good French companies on France. Uh, but we are really pre-committed to open source on contribution as well. We used to work for um, upstream deployment, and we always take care about when the customer allows us, give it back to the community when, it, when it's possible. Uh, I really would like you guys, and if we ask us what we are looking for, for sure we are looking for brand new customers, and we are on a way to extend our activities over Europe, mainly. But this is a sentence that we love from Mr. Weil. It's uh, really part of OADN. We are just replacing the word uh, have in a sentence by create, because that's really what we are doing for 10 years uh, within our, as a daily activity. We never trust the vendor. We don't have the hat of any vendor. We used to put our hand dirty in lab. We spend a lot of money and time and effort in R&D and laboratory testing and, and testing and screwing up plenty of components. And that's why our customers love us. And that's why we have the trust of some big customers. So you may have not heard about us before. So what, if you ask us what we are looking for, just first of all, follow us. And let's stay in touch, let's stay tuned, because next year we're going to announce some brand new products, something we are developing for more than two years now. And I think that's really something that's going to be interesting on the market, especially on the storage market. So let's stay in touch and give you the, the voice to my good friends. Thank you. Merci. Okay, so hi everybody. Uh, first of all, I want to thank you for being here and I want also to thank uh, Cécile and the whole team on, uh, of uh, Paris Région uh, that are giving us, uh, us the chance to be, uh, to be on stage today as uh, they are doing a great job. Um, so without further introduction, uh, let me introduce myself. My name is Kevin Messi. Uh, almost like the soccer player, uh, but my job is way more interesting. Uh, I'm BizDev at Ozone, uh, so let's get uh, straight to the point. Uh, what are we doing at Ozone? Uh, we are um, cloud experts, we are pure players. Um, basically, we are based on uh, um, two technologies. Uh, we go uh, with AWS, but not, on, not only for public cloud, uh, we are doing integrate integration, uh, we integrate applications. Um, we are also deploying uh, OpenStack Cloud uh, for big French companies and also uh, more uh, uh, government projects. So this is also really exciting. Um, last but not least, uh, we are giving trainings uh, in, fr in French, but we will have the chance to come back to that later. Um, so. Uh, what does it mean uh, to be um, a cloud pure player? Uh, well, we at Amazon, uh, at Ozone, uh, doesn't um, aren't trying to to go deploying uh, virtual machines on uh, uh, OpenStack just because it's hype and just because it's something new and exciting. Uh, we are really trying to do the best and to take the best of uh, of the technology. Um, we have. Pierre and Adrien, that you will be able to recognize thanks to our shirts uh, uh, with our name on the back. Um, they are really an um, OpenStack contributor, uh, uh, ATC. <laughs> um, and we are really involved um, in the life, in the community uh, around OpenStack. Uh, this is important where we try to share uh, the best practice and to give the most uh, to the customers uh, that we encounter. The, um, during our project. Um, we also want to contribute um, to OpenStack by giving uh, um, French-speaking trainings. Uh, this is something really important in France uh, because, as you may have noticed, we are not really good with foreign languages and it may be difficult. Um, we, are not, we are just a few doing that um, and we are trying our best to generate awareness and excitement about uh, the OpenStack. Um, of course, it's an open project, so our uh, course materials uh, are under Creative Commons uh, by SA license. Uh, you can go and get them uh, in our website, ozen.com. Um, so if you have any project or 
anything you want to just give a look, uh, just go uh, to visit our website. Um, so to finish, uh, as I told you, Pierre and Adrien uh, are really passionate about uh, OpenStack. Uh, they are also the founders of uh, the French-speaking um, user group of OpenStack. Uh, you can go and visit us at the booth. Uh, it's uh, E47. Uh, we will be happy to, to welcome you and to give you some uh, trip. Um, OK, and so our, you can find our information right here. So if you have any project, any question, if you are um, a company abroad that want to come to France or anything, we will be um, totally uh, available. You have my personal email. Um, OK, so thank you very much. And um, now that I explain what I'm doing, I'm really hoping that we will hear from you and that we will have the chance to uh, have a discussion about a nice project. Thank you very much. Tu m'as pas mis échappe. Ah bah. Hello everyone, I'm Jonathan Lelous, cloud leader for Server for Linux. I'm sorry to say that here, but we do everything expect except OpenStack. Okay? Why, why I would, would like to, do, to say that here? Because all the companies say we do OpenStack. We don't do OpenStack. We make an answer for the user. The user needs services. Okay? Company offer application for answer for this need, and company user pay company to have application to have serv uh, software as a service. Infrastructure support application, you know. And in this ecosystem, OpenStack it's only a building block. You know, you can run you can run an OpenStack if you. If you don't have application, and you, you, if you don't have user, if you don't have client, you have nothing. You are only great virtual machine. Okay, my company work with a client. We built who DevOps Cathedral, not Bazaar. I say Cathedral, you know, with open source. That's why the. Uh, the cathedral in the sky, uh, that's why we work with Puppet, with Jenkins, with Git, with many, many uh, open source tools around OpenStack, and who uh, only target, who only focus is to offer scalability, application scalability, to offer services, and to offer all the way. Uh, Savoir for Linux is a Canadian company based uh, in Paris now. We are more than uh, 100 experts uh, in open source. We are, we are a 15 years old company. And uh, today we work with uh, more than uh, uh, 100 open technology. And that's important. We have a high level of service quality and we work very hard to, to make a good job. If you would like to information, if you would like to work in Canada or in a great company, around OpenStack and with OpenStack, you could take my, my, the information here and uh, send me an email or what else. Thank you. Hi. Is it working? Yeah, OK. Hi, I'm uh, Stefan. Uh, as you can hear, I'm French uh, people. I work at uh, Alterway. Uh, which is one of the most important uh, open source pool player in France. And I got uh, five minutes to three minutes to tell you more about a very complex subject, which uh, uh, is around uh, OpenStack cloud hybridation. Um, so, as we have very few minutes, let's take a very simple use case. Let's see it. Uh, imagine a complex website uh, that you want to uh, be hosted part on a private cloud, on a public cloud. So we want your data on a 
private and very secure cloud hosted and managed by AltaWeb, for instance, and you want your front web and your search uh, engine in the public cloud, you want clusters everywhere, you want scalability everywhere. So how can you do that? How can you provision, configure, and deploy it on OpenStack Hybrid Cloud? From my point of view, for AltaWeb's point of view, there is only one solution, which is infrastructure as code. So, Altaire is a French cloud operator that can help you uh, for dealing with such projects. How? Using open source tools, as I said, we are an open source prepayer, so we are using a tool for provisioning, management, and monitoring uh, clouds. Uh, first of all, of us, we use uh, Fuel uh, from Mirantis to build the private clouds, and then uh, to uh, tools like uh, Capistrano to deploy uh, your website and your applications. And we also use Puppet, Ansible, uh, Console, and Sensu, uh, all that done by uh, uh, an, in, in, as infrastructure as code, sorry, uh, in Python or in Ruby. So if you want to know more, we, are, we have a booth here. Let's come to the E6 booth. And as we said in the French, et c'est pas fini, uh, or one last thing, as, uh, uh, another guy said. Uh, we also deal with a project with Docker. You may have heard of that. Uh, and lots of things can be done around Docker over OpenStack or on bare metal. So let's come and see us at our booth. Thank you very much.